Let's talk about it, y'all. So, I'm back again with another video. Uh, like I said, I'm trying to get back on this shit, but I ain't really been too busy this week because my new job is pretty easy. I like it. It's cool. You know, not gonna complain. So, who may it be that I work for? Uh, not them. But, right here. Small company out of North Carolina. Run the reefer. Uh, when I'm this temperature right here, I need that temperature right here. It's uh, 21 to be down instead of minus. So that way, you know, we're good. It's supposed to be minus 10, but as long as it get down under that uh, zero, we're good. It's frozen food, so you need to frozen. Matter of fact, let me see if I can show you inside the trail. Nice trolls. You can see yourself in the trolls, by the way. Nice trolls. Love these trolls, man. We got white trolls too, but these chrome trolls, they do it. Let's go check it out. Not sure if y'all can see in there. Y'all can't. But, you know, it's, it's pretty cool in there right now. Um, yeah, this is it. That's all, y'all. So, it's the next morning. Uh... Which is Friday. I go home today for 34. Come back on Sunday, one ounce of water. So, y'all probably get a little bigger that load in this video. You know what I mean? But, got the temperature on. Set at 20 degrees. It's dropping now. It's at 53. I got to pre cool the trailer before I get over to Columbia, which is a two hour drive. So, it should be at 20 by the time I get there. I just did my pre trip. I'm about to hop in the truck, roll out. Uh, this is why I like this shot, y'all. It's pretty easy. That's all I gotta do today. Take this down to Columbia, get this loaded like a miracle. They pretty quick. We're getting the loaded. Come back over. I go home. Oh uh, yeah. What's up, y'all? So as y'all seen in the last clip, yes, that's where I'm at. I'm over here working now. Um, I like it. Coming on I-75 northbound, coming through Georgia, heading up to McDonald's. Just left um, McClendon. Lindy, Florida. Uh, right outside of Jacksonville, delivering at the Walmart. My day goes to McDonald's right now. Then I'm gonna take that from McDonald's. We're moving to uh, Scranton, South Carolina, right outside Lake City. Florence, I think that's Florence County. Yeah, up in Florence County, South Carolina, you know, close to home. But I'm not sure if I'm making the house or not. Um, yeah, y'all. I like it, man. Uh, I've heard refrigerator. A lot of people like don't run refrigerator. You know, they, they can't deal with the vibration of the refrigerator on the bed at night. That doesn't bother me. You know, that I go straight to sleep. I be knocked out. I don't think I don't If you work hard enough, whatever the situation might be, I bet you I go to sleep. So I'm loving the reefer. It's fun. It, it gives you a little bigger, a little bigger excitement. Like it's not flat bag, it's not car hauling, but it's something to do. You know, drive in, all you do is load up. Strap down sometime and go, you know, close the doors and go. Briefly, you gotta pay attention. You gotta, you know, run that refrigerator. I think running on continuous stop and start, which you don't run stop and start here. That's the good thing. So I don't have to really much worry about that. Uh, keeping the temperature right. You know, we mainly use low locks. I might use straps on a low if I do a drop and hook, which is I don't need to drop and hooks rarely. Um, I might use uh, straps if I want to keep my low locks. Them shits cost about fifty dollars a piece. Um, but other than that, yeah, I'm chilling over here. I like it. I mean, it wasn't my first choice, but I'm kind of glad I ended up here. You know what I mean? Uh, what happened at US Express happened. It's over with. I'm gone. I'm on to do things, and I can't complain. You know, all, all I can do is thank God for where I'm at now. You know what I mean? And keep on moving. So, with that being said, I try my hardest to get content out, but the days be basically simple. I don't really be having time to pick up the phone so like i gotta say i'm gonna start recording on different angles and different things like whether it's just me talking and explaining things to you guys uh, if i can get a vlog out here and there like this i will try to make it as long as i can uh between seven to ten minutes at, at the most you know what i mean that's give you something about you know um, but yeah uh other than that y'all i'll get back with y'all when i get up here to uh, mcdonald's what's up y'all what's up so I'm not in South Carolina, but I'm still just outside of McDonald's here at um, the TA down here in Jackson, Georgia. Walking over here to the Loves, taking me a shower. 
I put my points and shit at. Um, so I got down to pick up and make dumbass and a damn um, trailer. The shit wouldn't go down to negative five where I needed it to go. It was set for set point at negative 10. I needed to get it down to get it down to negative five, but it wouldn't drop below 42. So I took it over to Thermo King and Conley and they did whatever the hell they did to it. I don't know, I don't ask no questions because I don't pay for it. <laughs> but they did whatever the hell they did to it. They fixed it up and got the temperature to drop down, you know, and everything. So now it's currently stuck at negative eight, you know, and it's supposed to be at the set point of negative 10. So it's doing this job. Um, I can't make it back over there to, I can make it back over there to the uh, pickup location because I only had like an hour left to my clock when my clock was running because I've been up since four this morning. And then uh, I did a split, but I didn't feel like fixing the clock and all that. And I really didn't have the time. So um, I just came over here and shut down, down here in Jackson, probably like uh, 20 minutes, if that, away from the uh, the uh, pickup tomorrow, just in case, you know, they keep the load. If they cancel it, you know, it is what it is. But, you know, I like to be close by. But that's what happened, y'all. I mean, uh, I try to keep y'all updated. At least pick up the camera tomorrow and show y'all where, where the hell I go from there. So uh, I get back with y'all. All right, y'all. So next day, Wednesday. Um, currently back here at the pickup location. Um, I got here earlier, like around nine, and um, they turned me around. They had refused to load me, so I posted got loaded yesterday. You know, but we know the deal with the reefer breaking down. So um. Then she told me, you know, when I pulled off, probably like five minutes of going down the road, she called, like, hey, you can come back. We're going to work you in, but we're going to charge your company a late fee for loaning you. Cool. They ain't got nothing to do with me. That's all on the company. So the company paid for the late fee. So now I'm sitting here probably about two hours now. Um, Still waiting to get worked in, but it's cool. Because the thing I'm going to explain to y'all in another video, I get paid regardless. That's a good thing about this company. You know, if it's not on me, I get paid. So this is not on me refrigerator broke down yesterday so i still get paid you know but i don't know if y'all can hear it running behind me but i can't you know i gotta want to stop and start now so i can save fuel and as long as it keep that temperature and that negative between negative five and negative ten we good so once i get back in the door then i turn it back on continuous only reason i do that is to save fuel in it you know what i mean because i'm i don't know how long i'm going to be sitting here and it's on the half a tank or well, it's just under half a tank so but i get back with y'all so the thing is, we are working. You gotta wait. You just gotta wait around. You know what I mean? You know, make sure it's about to be 12 o'clock. So actually, I've been here going on three hours. Uh, can't trip. You know, you were supposed to be here yesterday. I mean, I was. Uh, I gotta move this set point again because not the set point. I'm gonna turn it back off on two continuous because now it's coming to the drop Matter of fact, I'm gonna show y'all how I do that. So, this is where the temperature should be, negative 10. This is where it's at. Right now, it's on stop and start to save fuel. So, then I want to turn that stop and start off. I'm gonna hit the menu. Down, hold, select the mode. Select programming continuous mode, continuous. So now it's going to run until I turn it off. It's going to run until I hit this off button, which is that won't be until I drop this motherfucker off tomorrow. Back out. See, now it's going down. Like I said, I need this at negative 10. This is where the reefer fuel is at. It's just under a half a tank, so when I get up out of here today, I fill that motherfucker up. Right here. Let's go in the back and check. It's frosty back here, I'll tell you. It's cold as hell. When you open this up, and number frost gonna come back here. See? I don't know 
if y'all can really see the frost coming out here, but it's pretty cold. Uh, no matter the lot. So we really, you, you, you can use ratchet straps, but I rarely use them. You know what I mean? So I got them two gold locks right there, and I got four on the tractor. Prime, you know. But um, yeah, man, this is where I'm at now. Uh, I'm gonna try to get me a vlogging camera because uh, that's the reason I really don't be recording like that because I be on the phone a lot and I do videos with my phone. See, I got four right here. Yeah, I do videos with my phone, so that's why I really don't be recording this much because I be on the phone a lot. It's a lot to hang out with 